Oh, aloha nui kako. This is Mahina Minute. July 8th is Mauli, the 29th pole of our current malama, Kauna. Mauli is especially good for planting trees. For the farmer, Mauli meant dark, and he believed that the trees planted on Mauli would grow lush and full with dark green leaves. The puhala, or pandanus tree, is one such tree greatly valued by Hawaiians. In the old days, every Hawaiian woman was a lohala weaver. For Kapi'olani Naipo Pinkowski, caring for the puhala is one way that she honors the legacy of Ulana Lohala, or pandanus leaf weaving, left to her by her grandmother. I am here with the puhala, and puhala, other people know it as the lohala trees. And when I come here, I feel very, very close to my kupuna whether they are my, my own family or other people's family. So today, what I plan to do is to ho'omana, which means to, to take care of, to give life back to this puhala that, that I'm surrounded by. This particular puhala is native Hawaiian. It's an indigenous um, to Hawaii. Uh, ways that you can tell that it's native are by the thorns, uh, very masculine, and also by the, the swirling of uh, the actual growth of the puhala. In order to do ulana, to weave, you need to have the leaves of the puhala, and the leaves are known as the lauhala. But the purpose for me today to be here is really to take care of, of this puhala that I'm surrounded myself with. As you can see, these smaller pieces that actually have been hand cut, what I'm doing is I am taking it off. Because what happens is water gets into the creases, it becomes stagnant, and then it makes the puhala sick, ma'i. What I'm here to do is to just pull it off so that it can breathe. Much like how our kupuna cared for us, now I care for the kupuna. And so all I do is I just remove it as much as I can. So there's pieces like this. I am the third generation in my family to be a weaver. Um, but I feel that my calling within the journey of Ulana is to care for our puhala.